I'm Alfred McClure. I work for Sidney Lee Welding Supply here in the Atlanta, Georgia area, and uh, I'm an outside salesman. Capital City Machine is one of my customers I've had now for about four years. They were needing to increase their well output. At the time, they were running 15 pounds per hour of deposition. They needed to increase that to right at 60 pounds an hour. The only way that I knew how to do it was contact Miller and the engineering staff at Hobart. So we started out looking at just just basic wires. They were running a solid wire to start with. So we said if we switch to a metal core, we can typically increase um, deposition rates by about 30%. And we ended up deciding to go with two complete Miller sub-arc systems. So that was a 60% increase, if not more. When we changed over to the 600 pound drums, and we changed from a solid wire to a metal core wire, the returns have just went up drastically. We are using the Hobart EM13KS mod, metal core wire. Uh, we're running at around 37 volts and about uh, 750 amps. Uh, that is a uh, pretty high voltage and pretty high amperage, uh, and we're able to do that because of the metal core wire. We can't run solid wire as fast as we're running this new metal core wire. We more than increased what it was and then doubled it with the two heads. So the weld quality with the metal core wire We've seen great improvements, uh, you know, less defects, less rework. The welds are more consistent, there is less chance of any inclusions and slag, and less rework involved. When we made the change over to the metal core wire, we also changed over to the Hobart Flux, which has been fantastic. The flux peels off with no chipping and easy to recycle. We try to get, get it all back into the recycle bin. From a customer service standpoint and from a productivity standpoint, uh, it's just been excellent for us and for our customers. They understand the quality work that we're putting out, that they're very appreciative of it.